Hi, uh, this is Lynn Schnebley with Educating with Wisdom, and we are looking at uh, even earlier verification of that December 12 letter that I sent to the Law Society. So it would have been December 12, 2001. Notice I have 2001 here, and I have the wrong date on this. What you have seen online is this one, and all of these were opened up. This is my my older large computer. Actually, this is my laptop that they destroyed that I was working on, and they had destroyed the larger computer, my monitors, the malicious people that have gone after me, and um, that's a combination of government and LGBTQ, I don't know, Secret Service, Guy and Apple, Microsoft, I, don't, I have no idea. But let's look at December 12th, because this is the one I have online, and I'll open that up so that you can see that in a moment. And here we go. Now notice I have not updated that with anything, and here we go. Here is that. And I don't want to edit it. This was written in Word Perfect. And I have everything about the Union of North America and the, the, here we go, and we have this here, the Union of North America, the Canada Free Trade Agreement, what I'm really looking at is a Commonwealth, and I, I have that discussed as well. Toward the Union of the Americas, I have this all in here, the Age of the Indian, In God We Trust, which we don't or which god, I don't know. Um, I have the whole thing, the Logos and Matrix theory, the truth. I deal with primary archetypes and paradigms. Only Christian men have made God in their image without female attributes, not Christ. Christian men, why? Okay, so I, I go into the Adam I told Robert about all these things, who at that point was a bisexual, had been under Hatfield. He was one of, I guess, one of his guys. I don't know. That part's hearsay, but the other stuff wasn't. And I go through all of this. Now, we're going to look at the timestamp on that, because it, it's, people could say, now this was saved from the other computer, and it's been saved a few times. So you see it's saved there November the 9th, 2003. That particular piece did not go to the Law Society. That would have been copied and from the December the 12th or from a rough draft. Now, here we're going to open up the same letter, but let's go back and see when this was first modified. The fact that it's modified says that it came from something earlier modified here. It wasn't created here. It was created into... Um, the new portable hard drive on that day, but it was modified from that day, meaning, and meaning there was something that was, right. Now there's an even earlier one. Let's go in and see when the properties is for this. Created on that date as well, but it's modified from December the 17th, 2001. And this is an even earlier one. So all of a sudden now we're getting very close to sitting on top of that December the 12th, which was the finished product. I would have, this would have been simply the rough draft looking after it. I have no idea why the date was changed. I, it makes no sense to me. Now, Earl was supposed to have moved over those hard drives that I took off, my former fiance, and um, he was supposed to have moved it over from his storage unit. As well, I had the floppy disk that I had saved from that computer, and he I know he found it when we moved into the new storage unit because he asked me about it. I don't know if I still have it. He showed I I don't know. I don't know. But here it is, December the 17th, so let's open that up. And you'll see that it has to go through Office Libra. Here we go.
and this was an earliest version, I already had sent this out in the December the 12th and natural laws. You can go, I'll just go through it because you're going to see that it's the same document. I talk all about logos, hormones, uh, automatic thought disorders, all of these other kinds of things. God told me how to do this. Uh, paradigm shift. Multiculturalism. Regional disparity. We got. I got that wake up on the day the war broke out in 2001. Anyway, it sounds like I'm rambling. I'm just... So it's really the same document. It should be the same document. 21, my premonition regarding Udo. Now this is not what I sent them. That God and the law comes first, statute of common law is the fastest way. Okay. The end of the system would be about April 9th, 2000. <sighs> oh yes, I remember that, the prophecy that I had about Udo and he was traveling. That's interesting. I forgot that I had done that. Wow, that's interesting. Mm. Okay, let's see if that goes to December. If there's 21 pages. Oh, you can see that that one's not numbered. That's interesting. Aha. Uh -huh. That's an interesting thing. So you can see that I made a copy of it because it's not paginated. Holy smokes, this is a different copy of the same thing. Huh, interesting. And the other one is paginated. Okay, so let's put us on pause. Let's look at this further because again, well, it's, well, we'll come back. We just saw that, that one, this one is paginated. So it lets you know that I'm, I'm looking at different copies of everything. Interesting. Obviously, this can't be something. Yep. So this is all paginated. This one is not paginated. Let's see what I have online. So the older one was paginated. Hmm, interesting. Let's come out of this, put us on pause. Okay, here we go, Law Society. Because you're going to need this for the Americas. So let's look at just the December. December, I'm going to use my finger. December Then there's more. Okay. Two thousand and one, two thousand and one, April two thousand and one. Two 
can see that I'm handling a lot. And April, Texas Dickinson, some points and I'll find it. There it was, correspondence dated December 12, 2001. So that, that's actually my birthday. And it was actually a, a three, three, three. Ooh, gee. Hmm. Jupiter, Jupiter, Jupiter. And it adds all up to nine. Interesting. That was the year of, hmm. Okay, let's put it on pause and go in and see where it is online so you can see it. Here we go, for the Ambassador's original documents from 2001 and 2003. I talk about what so it's in here, and you can see what happens when I open things up. Alrighty, so all the documents. And it just told me there's a problem with this drive. They made it a crazy color. Let's, this is here, let's go into my documents here. And there we go. And thank you.